Mark, not a bad way to win the game today. What's your thoughts on the performance? Yeah, a great, uh, a great way to win it. I mean, scoring so late gives gives the opposition very little time to do to do much. So um, if you're going to win one one nil, that, that's the time to score. And uh, the boys showed all those characteristics that we've shown for such a long time now. That togetherness, that desire, that resilience. Um, tough conditions. Um, for a very good side. Uh, side they are so um, it's a real hard fought win and uh, we just about got it by the skin of our teeth. Uh, similar to the Kings Lynn game you know maybe we didn't start as brightly as we wanted to but we pushed and pushed and pushed and found the winner at the end. Yeah absolutely and conditions play a part in that we're playing against a very strong headwind on a lively pitch you can see by the conditions my wig's nearly flying off at the moment so uh, we had to contend with a lot but it was built on that that, that hard to beat um, you know which we're showing at the moment and yes we, we want to show more in such a big game, so much riding on it, it was a big week and um, you know, we, we, we had to nullify them. But I think we certainly did that, again, Mitch Monk was too much action. Second half they had a couple of moments in and around our box, but again we were there to snuff it out and uh, you know, we broke away well, we had to try to you know, hit the crossbar, thought it was a penalty, uh, and he's given it on the line in the 18 yard box, we had a couple of good free kicks right at the edge, so we definitely fought in opening opportunities. But every time we just threatened to get a hold of the game and get on, I thought we started the second half in a real good to stand strong again and uh, fortunately we've wrestled it back into our favour. Toby had to show a real bit of quality and delivery on the free kick, something that we you know we work on and he's, he's delivered it right on the money and uh, you know we, we, we fortunately got the goal the clean sheet of the all three points. Talks on Tuesday you said you know that result's gonna be a, a big point if we can get results today and you know both the results have gone your way today. Yeah and that's what it was, you know it's gonna be that you know we've conceded one in three, uh, you know two draws and a win. Like I said that that Follows, you know, makes uh, makes those two points look uh, a lot better. Two changes made. Obviously, Toby Edson filling at left wing back. A note on him. Also, a note on Kinsella, who misses out again today. Yeah, unfortunately, Lewis is still waiting. The results. Uh, well, we've got the results from his scan. He's waiting to see a specialist. He's seeing him early next week. So, fingers crossed on that one. Toby Edson has um, ended the game there on, on Tuesday. Started and finished the game there. Um, shows his football intelligence to drop Toby Edson into any position, I think. And he would um, put in a performance like he did today. So, uh, it's great to have him back. He's another one we've had to be careful with. I could have just put him back and go in nine eighties and you know, had to build him up with a few half hours here. And I know he's been chomping at the bit and uh, he was probably delighted to start today, even though it'd be in a slightly different position, but he just showed his, his quality and how important he is to us. Yeah, Tommy also came back into the side and also Scotty Wilson on the bench for the first time today. Yeah, that's great. So you have young Tommy he just just tweaked his groin last week, so he was been unavailable for the last two games, but it just shows how important the squad is. You know, people look like they're straight back in, that's always been the case here, we, you know, it's horses and courses, we try and pick the right team for the right occasion, um, delighted to get Scott Wilson in, uh, forward with great experience, still a good age, and I think he'll be hungry after probably having a little bit of an injury hit season, he's got great pedigree, he's won this league before, he's got a lot of goals in this league, so, you know, hopefully we'll see more of him to come, the way the game panned out a little bit, and with him only arriving on Friday, uh, made it a little bit more difficult to bring him on today, but I'm sure with a, a, week's, a week's work next week in our environment, uh, then, then we'll see we'll see more of him. Of course, that's two clean sheets in three now, so uh, you know you touched the defence, and a massive improvement as we look to build on this now. Yeah, look, we're showing a good de defensive resilience, and um, we needed to, and we had to change it. You know, this, this group has rallied. You know, a lot of people had us dead and buried a long time ago, and uh, the, the way the group stood up and to be counted, and um, the characteristics it's showing, and the desire, and, and the hard work. You know, they've, they've got to be applauded for that, but we ain't done nothing yet. We've secured a vital three points today, and it's now, that's gone, now it's what we do next. And of course, the next game is Barnet away, sorry, Barnet at home, even another important game. Yeah, it's the next game's always the biggest, you know, Barnet being Brennan's a very good manager, who's really steered that ship around, I think, probably similar, he took over, they, they were in a similar position that, that we were, and he's managed to turn it around, drive them up the league, and again, they've got lots of quality, lots of experience, so training this week to be ready for. Are you a movie shot? Look below for more information. Click here for the next video. Click here to subscribe.